Hello. Um, today I'd like to show you the. This is a Helix uh, lockable box file. It takes uh, a four and slightly larger um, files um, and papers. And the idea is that you put the papers in here, you close it, you lock it, and um, your files are secure. Uh, it's made of plastic. It has an inner uh, shell that's, that's actually metal, um, but the bottom is all plastic, and obviously the top here is all plastic, and it, it's it's metal here with the lid, and so it's a good section, but it's actually plastic. Um, and I would imagine that if you you know you could possibly get here, that is a lip. Like this. There's a lip, so you can possibly bend this back. Um, but we're not interested in this kind of access because if somebody wants to get access to these files, maybe they want to have a quick look at the file, um, take a picture of something, then uh, this doesn't really give you a lot of security. You could buy this thinking that you've got plenty of security, you've got plenty of safety with this file. But in actual fact, you don't know very much because in here we have a we have a wafer core, and we know very well that wafers are very poor quality as far as locks are concerned. So I'm trying to get a, an angle on the camera where I can show you how to, I'm going to pick this. I'm going to use the worm. This is this is Sparrows 18,000 uh, and homemade tension wrench. And to be honest with you, this, 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 this wave flux can sometimes open with the first, you, know, you put something, it opens straight away. Sometimes it can take a little bit more effort. So I'm going to try to find a, an angle whereby I can, you can sort of see this on camera. It might make picking it a bit more difficult, but put the pick in. That's all I did. Put it in, little jiggle. There we go. We're open. And all I have to do now is zoom out, do this, and we're open. Boom, boom, we're in. Um, if I do this, I'm just going to show you that this box, if we can get the camera to cooperate, here you can see the box shell is metal. And um, the base is just plastic. So the only thing that's protecting this is the, the, is the sides. And this bit is metal, uh, fastened together. Um, the base and the top is all plastic. So you go in, go in, take your file, take a picture, check what you want to get any information out of it. Close your file up like this. And then as long as you don't do this all the way, otherwise you have to re-pick this. Um, then you just put your tension wrench back in and turn it like such and you're locked. And nobody would know that you've been in, been into the files, taken information which should not be viewed, and <clears throat> do whatever you do with it. I think this kind of product, um, although it's okay for very low security applications, I think people probably buy this product. Some people buy this thinking that the you know there's a lock, um, you need a key, and this thing is going to be relatively secure because I can go down here again. This is metal, and the top is plastic. But the people are going to be thinking that this is still giving a certain amount of security. And in effect, it's not actually giving you the security that you really, really need. Um, I certainly wouldn't trust any very important files or any important information in this. And you saw very easily how it was uh, easily opened with using the Sparrow's Worm. There we go. Sparrow's Worm. And a simple... Or made tension wrench. 
Uh, you could probably pick this with a city rake and a single pin pick this quite easily. But for, as a low skilled attack, you are talking something as simple as this. You know, into the lock, a bit of a jiggle. You saw I put it in, I, all I did was put it in, give it a little bit of a wiggle and it was open. Um, these kind of cases do need um, some kind of improvement on these kind of locks, I personally think. Just for very, very, very low security and you know, you, you're aware of the fact that you know, this is only plastic and you know, someone could get in and break it open. But if you want something stored away and you're concerned that people might get access and, uh, and you don't know, this does present quite a vulnerable um, uh, quite a vulnerable way of giving you security that's not going to be adequate. So that's the Helix uh, box file, lockable box file. A uh, good percentage of it's plastic, that's the Helix sign. Um, personally, I think that this is okay, providing you actually improve this lock. But then again, lots of these kind of products uh, have wafer locks and we know how poor they are at securing things. So that's the Helix box file. Thanks for watching and thanks for spend, taking the time to view my video. Take care, look after yourself and you have a nice day. Bye bye now.